Hi, I'm Wilson, and today I'm so glad because after one week coding, finally this new firmware of MIDI Captain Mini 6 and just for KPP has been finished. So the most important feature of this new firmware is that it can communicate with KPP with just a USB cable and in a dual way. So it can get the rig name from the KPP and also get the A slot, B slot, and a delay and a reverb status and a display in this screen. So it will be much more convenient to use. Let's take a close look at it. Okay, the function definition is very straightforward. KPP has every five presets in a group and has 10 group. So let's see how we can assess all the presets. One, two, three, four, five. The next group, just long press this one. We go to the next group. And if you want to go even further, three, four, five. So if you want to go back, long press this button. By this way, you can assess all the 50 presets. Now let's take a close look at the screen. You will see the name of the uh, presets here. Also, you can see here the A, B, D, R. This means the slot A state, slot B state, and the delay module, delay module state, and the reverb. Also, you can change. Long press A, you can close it. If now it's on off state by long press, you can activate activate B and this is for delay this is for reverb so let's see the reverb now is on yeah we can we can just turn it off so the long press will not affect the presets the presets is still 3 1 this foot switch is designed for tapping we can see the tapping speed can be synced also the benefit is the tapping speed can be displayed here with a number. Now let's see how it works. Guitar here. In this preset, let's turn off the delay and reverb. Okay, that's all the demonstration and if you like it, you can go to our website and find the product page and find where to download the firmware. By the way, and uh, there will be something big. In this year, we're going to release maybe the world's first, uh, how to say it, maybe computer facts. So this device will include a totally full functionally computer as well as a high-end audio interface and also the MIDI controller. We already have this prototype machine on last October and in, in Shanghai Music Expo. And we got so many, so many people interested in it. The schedule is a little bit delayed, but for sure we will bring this out. Okay, see you next time.